Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys. We're going to be playing a new game today by Plarium, guys. It is called Stormfall Rise of Belor. Look at those sweet graphics on that intro screen. Um, one of the cool things about this... Oh, look, they're having a sale. One of the cool things about this... like I've kind of just been messing around with it. Um, so you guys are going to learn a lot with me as I learn right here. Um, but I've been interested in vertical games because I don't always like having to hold my uh my device horizontal you know what i'm saying so one thing that i noticed about this right off the bat is just that it's cool that you can do that um that you can hold it vertical and play um around like that so it is like a castle attack look at that dragon <laughs> it is like a castle attack style game but the graphics and whatnot are, whatnot are different from a lot of the games that um are popular out there like clash and uh, Plunder Pirates, games like that. So this one's pretty cool um, just because uh, A, of the vertical aspect of it, and it's actually like kingdom, like knights kind of stuff. Um, but we're going to go ahead and we're just going to build some of these uh, mines over here. So it looks like we can finish them for free when we build the first one. Master Builder Award up there. Uh, if all of these are free, I'm just going to go ahead and build all these up. Um, it is costing me resources, though. Um, we're just going to keep on building this. I should have turned off those notifications uh, level 6, you gain 800 experience. Awesome, okay. Um, and then, yep, we'll build up this other mine right here. Build up this other mine right here. And then I got on earlier to train up troops, guys, so that I wouldn't have to uh, wait while we're here. Level 7, nice. So we're getting all that just from upgrading all of these things. Um, so here is here's kind of the layout of it from what I understand so far. Uh, you've got your main castle right here, uh, and or the keep. And so you can actually go into it and you can go upgrade requirements to upgrade it. So if I want to upgrade my keep again, then I need to build a farm level 5. So I can press on go and I can upgrade that and then it'll be done. Um, so that's awesome right there. Let's see what else is going on. So we got this lady up here in the corner. Um, I guess she's my lady and I'm the king or whatever. Uh, upgrade buildings to level 2. All right, so we can claim all these rewards. So I guess she has all the rewards for us and you can see what it's giving us. Down there in the bottom. Wow, looks like I did a whole bunch of stuff. Um, and then here's a whole bunch of quests as well, like build a warehouse level three, all these different things. Um, and it looks pretty cool. I'm liking the graphics and kind of old style feel. Like it's not too, it's not cartoonized like a lot of games nowadays. Um, but you look in the bottom. So the black market, I guess, is like uh, the store where you can spend real money if you want to uh, to buy anything uh, with the gems or whatever the currency is in the game. Uh, you can join a league, which is cool. So the league hall is where you may unite to fight under the banner of an existing league. That's cool. Oh, I can join this one. What happens with not enough training space with the league academy? Okay, can I join this one? Did I join it? Nice. So I just joined this random league. I'll have to do a little bit more diving into it and figure out exactly what goes into leagues and whatnot. But that's what's cool about these games at the beginning is that you always kind of get to learn them. Look at all of my villagers around here just walking around. I love the passive graphics that are in this as well. Uh, what is this one? Oh, okay, so Lost uh, or lost Art. So you collect these things, and I guess they build towards whatever. So this first one, uh, Lost Art Master. If you wish to protect and expand your realm to the farthest reaches of the horizon, you must master the... Okay, so that helps you uh, move along. So we can go over here to Units, guys, and um, you can see that I have all of these guys trained up right now. Wait, do I only have one? You can come in here, you can scroll over, you can train them up uh, and whatnot. Can we boost that? Uh, nine of it. Let's just, let's boost this. Does that just get rid of a minute time? <laughs> that only gets rid of a minute time uh, for 10 gems. So it does take a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and look over here. So the bottom left, we have the map, I guess. And you can scroll out and look at this. You can go, all, all these people are people that you can attack. I think that, like, the exploration of this is really cool. I used to play a game like this a long time ago. I don't even remember what it's called, but it was probably like two and a half years ago. I used to play it, and I loved that you could go around to all these different kingdoms. Like, you can tell who'd be like this guy right here, level 36. Obviously, he plays a lot. Same with the level 19, level 16. Like, they've actually gotten to the point where they can name their base. I haven't even been able to name my base. There's a level 39 right there. Wow. And then in the top right, you can see that little uh, thing that tells me how many kilometers I am away from my actual... Um, home so my home where's my my home's right here um i just say pet underneath that's interesting 
Ogre's Castle. So let's go check on this. Attack or defend in battle and earn. Let's raid this. We're going to raid this and see what happens. Oh, so I've got a bunch of cavalry. Can I use all of them? I want, I, I'm want. i going to use them all to see if I get any of them back. I've got some paladins and stuff. We're going to go all out on this thing and we're going to attack this. Defense units. Oh, okay. So who am I? Okay, so we don't want to do... Oh, no. So we don't want to use our cavalry because I guess they're defense. So we're not going to use the cavalry. Look at all these infantry that I have trained up. Um, look at this. So uh, let's see here. In transit, so six seconds. You can see it in the bottom right. That's cool. There's a dragon over it. So we're in transit right now with uh, all of our units are going to be there soon. Level eight, you gain. All right, sweet. So I guess that we already, did we already beat it? Yeah. <laughs> so it calculates it almost immediately with whatever algorithm there is. Uh, so who did we lose? So we lost three of our infantry. Um, I think that's what it's saying. Losses. Zero out of 22, one infantry. Oh, and then they, the enemy had three. Interesting. Okay, cool. So victory right there. Healer, what do I want to do? What is this? Uh, no, we're good. All right, so we're going to go back to the map, guys. And what is this one? Let's attack this little, let's attack this one as well. Uh, we're not going to send them again. We're going to send all these guys. Archers. The archers are defensive? Interesting. All right, so we're going to go attack again. And Oh, quest, win a battle. Sweet. So once that's gone, so you can see, again, it's only another six seconds for us to get over there. Um, now, the cool thing is you can time it to where when you go to sleep, you can send something like two hours away uh, and then get how much do you enjoy the game. Please rate. I'm still playing it. But I'm enjoying it so far. So we're definitely going to rate that uh, eventually. But let's see if we lost anybody. So we only lost one of our infantry again. Uh, spoils of War. Nice. So we're getting a lot from all these uh, from all these close bases right here. Um, and uh, yeah, I don't know, guys. I think it's cool. I just kind of want to introduce you all to it. Uh, I like the fact that you can scroll around to all these different people. Why don't we go ahead and do that? Why don't we find somebody that we think we can... A tie that's like a low level, but it's kind of far away. And then we'll see what happens in the next one. So I'm actually going to raid this guy. And it's going to take offense, defense. All right, cool. And it's going to take, let's see, eight minutes time. So that's cool. So we're going to go ahead and send them, guys. And then uh, I'll let you guys know how that went in the next episode. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. Uh, try the game out. Try the game out. It is called, uh, how did I already forget what it was called? Oh, Stormfall, Rise of Balar. Yes, that's what it is. <laughs> I drew a freaking blank like crazy. So go check out Stormfall, guys. Um, I definitely think y'all are going to like it. I love the vertical aspect of it. It's kind of a break from being here, and you can be here. And then people don't really know you're playing the game all the time. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see y'all in the next episode. As always, make sure you keep calm and you play on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.